I'm Scott Hayden. I'm a digital innovation specialist at Basingstoke College of Technology and I'm a lecturer as well of creative media production and a diploma in teaching as well. My role has been, it's been evolving for the last few years. I started off by teaching media primarily and focusing on film, TV, journalism, blogging, social media and Increasingly, I've been using more and more educational technology as a tool to facilitate learning and to help my learners to demonstrate their evidence of understanding through video, iPads, blogs, social media and different multimedia evidence to show they know in a way that they're familiar with and are used to. So being led by them almost. My role using social media has helped me to get some exposure as well in the sense that my students use social media to build up their digital reputation. Every single lesson they use Twitter on hashtag debates, they um, discuss politics, sexuality, racism, gun control with students across the ocean in our ATO debate. Um, so guys in Basingstoke, Hampshire are arguing with people in Birmingham, Alabama on a set hashtag about particular critical thinking topics, learning to develop their communication skills, the art of being succinct and to the point, using good literacy skills and good numeracy skills as well to get them to get it in 140 characters and in five minutes. That's quite a nice way to get English, maths and ICT in one activity in our Twitter debates. Using Periscope to live stream video debates across the ocean and with our friends in a, at University of Barcelona as well, we've been debating with them as well. We use Tumblr and WordPress to document video, image and text evidence throughout a project, whether it be uh, a moving image a film project or whether it be something related to photography or a journalistic uh, project like film studies, for example. All the while, the students are adding to their digital online reputation and portfolio that makes them employable beyond the course. So they can go into that apprenticeship, university course, or paid work after the course. They get a qualification and they get a digital reputation, the Twitter account, their LinkedIn profile, whereby they can endorse each other's skills and comment and reference, write references for one another as well. So the use of social media, LinkedIn and Twitter is integral, as is Facebook. We use Facebook to communicate with industry. So all the work students do, they publicise it, they raise awareness, they crowdsource as well, using social media to connect with industry and to publicise their work beyond just the BTEC or A-level, whatever the qualification is. So it can be seen as real life ramifications to it, working alongside a third party clients in industry as well who then can give us feedback on the work as well as the assessor giving feedback on the work. We use Snapchat as well to document evidence throughout projects with students reflecting and giving their thoughts and their understanding of the terminology or what the project is or just doing vlogs from behind the scenes of their project, reflecting on their progress as they go, Instagram to photograph projects that are visual and commenting underneath as well to give each other peer feedback as they progress. Recording one minute videos as well on Instagram is a really nice way to, again, create mini vlogs for them to um, demonstrate reflection as well as communication skills and comment on each other's work, that constant peer review and communication and critical thinking being embedded in all of this social media work. So we use social media quite a lot, it's fair to say. and. In 1617, I'm going to be hopefully rolling that out across all courses here at Basingstoke College of Technology. So we've embraced the Feltag report and the movement, as it were, and we're now sort of moving forward to use social media to underpin our move towards blended learning and Google Apps for Education as well in the future. By using Google Classroom as the hub for all of our blended learning activities and using social media to connect our students to industry and to build up their digital reputation alongside their use of blended learning.